she was selling the life that corporate America wanted women to live. Propaganda is half-truth, selected truth, and truth out of context. It isn't just a bunch of lies. And one thing that people don't recognize about propaganda when they look at it, you look for the things that aren't there. The things that are invisible. There's no kids, there's no women, there's no pregnancy. It's about sex, it's about products, it's about this materialism. Right. Pregnant women and moms were an inconvenience to Helen Gurley Brown, just like they were to a lot they of were. employers. She urged young women to sleep their way to the top. What did Betty Friedan think of Helen Gurley Brown and Cosmo? She thought Cosmo was quite obscene and quite horrible. She said that Cosmo, which was turning women into a sex object, uh, was denying women's full personhood. Just to turn women into a sex object was not at all what she had in mind. She was fighting for equal respect and dignity in education and the work. So this was, these two were two radically different movements.